Rockin' Larry Lockin', Dating Express Productions, your host with the most from coast to coast, giving you coolness, hotness, and whatever you wantedness. Hey, it's the middle of the night from the West Coast of the United States, uh, overlooking the Pacific Ocean, um, on the Oregon Coast to be exact, uh, West Coast USA, East Coast of what was Lemuria, like I like to say. Um, I'd like to talk a little bit about um, admining and marketing Starseed related groups on Facebook, Starseed related groups, Starseed uh, related pages, um, in my case, Pleiadian related groups and pages to be exact. Um, some tips I would like to offer is that if you have a group out there or a page and are looking to share it, um, you know, of course, there's the conventional way of just go ahead and sharing it with different groups, which, which you know, that can you know, I think everybody knows that, you know, you can do that and hopefully everybody does do that that wants to um, increase the volume and numbers in their group or page because if you just create a group or a page like a lot of people I know, it's it's not going to go anywhere. You have to market it. I mean, that's something that you're going to have to do and there's a lot of little ways that you can do that besides just sharing it to groups. You can... You know, you, you can just be in a group and when you see a post, per se, that relates to your group or page, you can post it in the comments. For instance, you know, I've created or have been a part of creating around 35 Pleiadian and Starseed related groups. Um, I add them in for another 10 or so and I've also created 14 or 15 pages as it relates to these subjects. And you can post it in comment sections when people are talking about that issue or if you see that they're talking about a particular region that they're from of the world and your group or page relates to that like a lot of the groups that um, I've helped create do you know post it in the comments or privately message them and send that now one of the frustrating things with me that I people get hung up on all the time is and it just it, I really have to keep my cool with this because in, in show love is that they'll they'll be like well, I've got a phone. I don't have a PC. I just use a phone. And, you know, at first I was like, you know, that, that's really annoying to be quite honest. But the fact of the matter is, okay, that's the reality of it. But the reality of it is, too, is that with a phone, you can do it just as easy. I mean, all you have to do is ask somebody with a PC. I'd be glad to do it for any of my admins, but of course they never ask or maybe they don't care to ask, but that's their thing. Um, all you have to do is, you know, for instance, like if somebody, if I had an admin who was, say, the admin of the Pleiadian Reiki group or the Twin Flame group or one of the many regional groups we have, all I would do is I would go ahead on my PC and I would, I would copy the group description, you know, and then under it I would copy the link to the group and then take that you know, before, you know, put it in like a generic box, like you're going to post it, but do, don't do it. Highlight, copy the entire thing, then take it to a private message with that person and um, paste it in there. And so at that point, all they have to do is copy that entire text that I sent them and paste it to a group or paste it to a um, post in a group as a comment. Um you know, it's really that simple to do. And with a phone, you know, you can do that. And then, of course, you have some people that say, well, I can't copy from my phone phone or paste but or my tablet. But, yes, you really can. I would love to be around these people so I could just show them. It's so really simple that really all you have to do is touch that area, you know, play with it a little bit, touch it a little bit with your finger, and you can get the entire thing to light up blue or whatever. And then once it does that, take your finger off, and then you can tap it again slightly, and an option will come up to copy it. Well, there you go. Then you've got it copied, and then all you've got to do, of course, again, is go to wherever you're going to post it as a post or a comment, and tap it in that tap that box um, a certain way, and then an option will come up to paste and hit paste. It, it's it's really simple to do. A lot of people will create all these groups. And um, they won't share them ever. 
they'll just create these groups and expect that they grow. But really, I mean, that's kind of pointless and counterproductive to do when you do that because, I mean, you've got to market your group. You've got to get that word out there. If you don't do it, nobody else is going to do it. And that that's just the bottom line. And if you were going to go to all the trouble of creating these groups and have really nobody in them, which a lot of star seeds do, I see it day in and day out. And I know that um, myself and, you know, um, my divine flame, I don't like using labels, but my divine flame, Sith Gunner's daughter and myself, we laugh about that all the time because people will create these groups and post and post and post and post. And there's nobody commenting in there. Why do that? You could just talk to yourself. But on the other hand, I mean, you could take two seconds of your time and share that group, even with a phone. And, and we're so intelligent as star seeds. I don't understand. I think that it's a situation where we overthink it too much. I mean, it, it, it's like with myself. You know, I couldn't tie my shoes until I was almost nine years old. My parents, my grandparents were so frustrated with me. Yet by the time I was eight, I had a hundred years worth of presidents memorized and um, all this music trivia, sports trivia that would blow adults away. But yet I couldn't tie my shoes because I was overthinking it. Um, I think Tesla and Einstein had that same issue. I'm not saying I'm anywhere in their league, but it's really simple to do. And I think what frustrates me is that nobody ever asks for help. And I've told my admins several times that, if they need any advice, if they need any help, just ask me. And it's so simple. Um, you know, I had an admin of mine the other day I really, really, really love. Um, Hank, Hank Johnston of California, Pleiadians, a great, 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 wonderful soul. And, you know, he was using a phone. He said, you know, I really want to share this group, but, you know, I don't really have that option on my phone. And I said, you know what, hang on, man. Give me, give me a minute. I've got a fix for you. And he was patient enough to be cool with it and say, okay, cool. So I got back to him with that. I had his group and the group description above it all in one text. The group description and the link to it all in one text. Sent it to him. I said, look, man, all you've got to do is copy this. right? Just copy it right now and go to whatever group you want to post it to. Go to the post part or go to a post and a comment part and hit paste. It's, it's as easy as one, two, three. I mean, it's like taking candy from a baby. Okay? It's just really that simple to do. It's easy. And like I said, with a tablet or a, or a phone, I mean, I hear it so many times. Oh, I can't do that. I got a tablet. I got a phone. I can't do it. Well, have you ever taken two seconds to take your finger and tap on it, mess around with it a little bit, and get it to highlight blue? copy it, then paste it. It, it. It's simple. Okay. I mean, these are brilliant, super conscious minds I'm talking about. Some of the most super conscious minds I've ever dealt with, even more so than me in a lot of the cases. And it's just like, wow, you're a trigonometry major, but you can't figure out how to tie your shoe. And it's a matter of calming down for a second and just listening and, and, and you know, just taking that time to do that. Okay, because we've got to do that. We've we've got to do that. We've got to take that time to stop and come into 3D a little bit and do things like that. Especially if we just have a phone and are on the internet all the time with that. Okay, which is fr frustrates me with people that are just on their phone all the time on the internet and don't have a PC. But that's a whole other subject. It's probably that I'm irritated about that because of some of the issues I've ran into with people that are you know, too scared or whatever, or won't share it or won't um, listen to my advice when I please ask them to post it to the Mothership Pleiadians group once a week. I mean, take two seconds of your time and do this. I mean, you've got all this time to sit there in private chats and do this and yada, yada. But man, take two seconds, two seconds of your time. Take another 20 seconds to learn how to do it. And, it, and it's that easy. It's that simple. And it really is. It's that simple to do. Um, you'll be ashamed of yourself when you realize how simple it was. Okay? And I, I, you know, and I have to bite my tongue a lot not to harp on people for not doing that. But anyway, regardless of that, 
Um, these are just some of the things that you can do to share your group. And, you know, you, you just let it flow through consciousness when the right time to do that is. But the biggest problem and the biggest fear is not knowing when to do it or doubting yourself. If you have any doubt at all, who cares? Screw it. Post it. So a group may get mad. Most groups are cool with it. Any legitimate starseed group, whether it's a Pleiadian group, an Arcturian group, a Syrian group, whatever the hell it is um, on Facebook, they're cool with it. If not, piss on them. Leave the group. I mean, we're all one at the end of the day. That's what I say. I encourage everybody and anybody to start their own group, start their own page, right? Who cares? Flood the masses with it. Flood the masses because eventually it's all one and we all intertwine together. So, you know, th those are just the things you can do. And, you know, even from a phone um, or a tablet, it takes all of about, uh, oh, two minutes to create a page or a group. I mean, it, you know, if I were some kind of a con artist, it would almost be a field day because, oh, that's so wonderful you created this. Oh, that's so wonderful you created that. But it takes two seconds. The biggest problem is is finding the picture to put as the banner and then, you know, taking them one second it takes to think up a group description for it or a page description. That's it. And then that's it. And that's all you do. And then there it is. Bada boom, bada bing. It's up and running, you know, and it, and from that point on, you know, share it here and there, you know, share it to all the groups that you're in, share it on posts in these groups that relate to it, you know, get the word out there, okay, because if you don't do it, nobody else will, it's that easy, it's really that easy, we're our own worst enemy when it comes to that, because I don't care what device you're on, I really, let me put it to you this way. If you're able to comment and you're able to post in any group or any page, well, guess what? It's just about as simple to share a group, share a page, create a page, create a group. It's easy. It's simple. I mean, you're better than that. You ought to be ashamed of yourselves for not Picking it up like that. I mean, I'm not the most brilliant guy at all. In fact, I'm very, very, you know, I, I think I have a fairly high consciousness. But, you know, IQ-wise, I'm probably not that smart. And I see people that are so much more smarter than me that won't do it or are too lazy to do it. or But yet they'll sit there and comment and ramble on and on about everything. But yet they won't take the two seconds to promote this for humanity. I won't say it promote the cause, promote the movement. That's those are labels, but this is for humanity. Okay? And have a little pride in your group. Have a little pride in your page. Share it. Share it everywhere. Share it. Flood the groups with it. Once, twice, couple times a week, couple times a month, whatever. But besides that, pick up on posts that are related to that, right? And post it in there. You know, if somebody wants to join it or like it, they will. If they don't, they don't. That's it. You know, there's no other hidden agenda. You just put the word out there. Put your group out there. Put your page out there. And I mean, and I mean this in all sincerity. Not just the <clears throat> admins that, um, admin um, for me, the, you know, the 30, the 25 or so regional groups and the other 10 related groups that I've helped create, if they have a question about it, message me privately. I mean, they could have already been promoting this a long time ago. And and at this point, taking all of 30 seconds of their time a week to do, if that. They could have long since been doing that. Instead of staying stuck in this perpetual merry-go-round of 3D and really not going anywhere. Okay, um, you know, any of my admins that, uh, that that are, you know, under me per se for the Pleiadians mothership group, you know, Admiral Shapiro's group, um, you know, the, the other admins in that group, you know, they message me, 
it's simple. I'll even do it for you. I'll copy paste it, give it to you in a private message. I'll walk you through how to do it even with a primitive phone or tablet. And trust me, if you're on a phone or a tablet where you can even be messaging me on, well, it's just that simple to go ahead and copy and paste it as well. Awaken to your power. Know how great you are. Put the message out there. Okay. Um, you know, unless you don't want to, then just come clean and say you don't want to. I would respect, you know, really, I would respect that more than anything. If somebody would say, you know what, I just don't care. I just want to create a bunch of groups and not do anything with it and just hope uh, it will immaculately grow. Well, it's not going to. Okay. I mean, yes, if you are financially well off, you can um, pay Facebook to promote these groups or pages for you. But let's face it, none of us are. But these are just some of the things you can do. You know, I mean, for instance, I'll go through it again. You know, uh, about a year ago, I had the consciousness come to me from the Pleiadians to create two groups in one night. Um, the Pleiadian Reiki Healers Group and the Pleiadian Twin Flame Group. So I thought about it, and then I went into this um, private chat that I had set up for admins in the Pleiadians group, and I said, hey, we know, what does everybody think of these two ideas? You think, you know, these would be good ideas? And people are like, yeah, sure, sure, go ahead and do it. And so I went ahead and created those right away. It, it took all of, again, about four minutes to create them both. And, um, of course, you know, the, the major problem was finding, a, you know, the right picture and the right... Uh, description but you know really that's not a problem at all and what I do with those groups is of course I, I will post them from time to time in different um, related groups or um, post them or have admins that um, run those groups for us now for the collective now um, do that as well at least I ask them to um, a lot of them don't even though it would take two seconds of their time but you know, more so than just posting it here and there, look for little, look for posts. Don't look, but when you're in a group, you know, you're going through posts, whatever, you find uh, somebody that has a question about a twin flame or a question about Reiki, or, you know, they're from a certain region of the world and you're looking to connect with people from that region. Well, you know, they're perfect opportunity perfect opportunity to post your group if it relates as a comment say hey check this out they want to they will if they don't they won't it's that simple you know it's really easy it's not going to grow by itself you know unless you just want to have like i said and i know people that it sure fellow starseeds might it sure seems like that all they want to do is create a bunch of groups and then never do anything with them never you know, add a few people here and, you know, and there and never want to promote it. And it's so easy. And I don't know why they would want to do the world, not only the world, but themselves, the injustice of not doing that. Just do it. Just do it. You know, I mean, we've long since passed the time of being shy or, you know, being scared of stepping out of your comfort zone. That's just being... You know, that's not, that. that's just being selfish at this point. Get out there. Get the word out. Stand in your power. Offer it. You know, you, you'll get some, of you know, once in a fluke of a fluke of a blue moon, you'll get some of these, you know, a group that, oh, we don't advertise in here, don't do that or whatever. Well, whatever. Well, then chances are that isn't a group that uh, you want to vibrate with. Okay, that's an ego-based mentality, right? Because at the end of the day, we're all one group. You know, that's an ego-based mentality to have that opinion. Now, I'm not talking about when I say advertising. I'm talking about Ray-Ban sunglasses or, or whatever, you know, things of that nature. I mean, but we should all be loving and accepting of people posting a page or a group to our group or page that's related in content. I mean, as long as it's anywhere in the ballpark and they're not completely flooding you with it all the time, you know, let it happen. If you don't, I mean, well, that's your ego and your problem, and that's something you need to work on. But I just want to wish everybody much love out there, and, 
you know, if you have any questions on this particular matter, please privately message me. I mean, it, it's simple. Um, I think I pretty much laid it out, but uh, I will definitely walk through it, walk anybody and everybody through it on an individual basis, you know, because I don't mind because this is what I'm all about and this is what I feel like this is all about. And to be honest, you know, it'll take all of about 30 seconds of my time to show you. Okay. And so with that being said, and I know I'm all over the board, but it's really easy. It, it, it's really simple to do, you know. Um, and if you don't want to, you know, that, that that's one thing too. But if you're going to be an admin, you know, you have to at least take that 20 seconds a week that it takes to do the work and do that. You know, I mean, otherwise you're just doing yourself and the rest of the Starseed community an injustice. And, and then that's it. And there's really no two ways about it. Um, you know, uh, it's, if you disagree with what I say, well, that that's one thing. But, you know, if you then again, if you really are about helping awaken humanity, you know, then then you'll figure then you'll then you'll do what I then you'll do this or you'll ask. And I'd be glad more than glad to help. You know, it kind of hurts me and frustrates me that nobody ever asks. When it's not like a situation where you're, where, you know, you'd be afraid to ask for somebody for, um, whether it's financial support or help with trigonometry homework or, you know, some big issue like that. But, I mean, this is some little, you know, and, I, and I'm trying not to cuss on air, but this is some little chicken shit thing that it, it takes two seconds to figure out. You know, so, so ask. You know, I mean, it, and if not, you know, if you're not interested in that, well, you know, maybe consider stepping down as an admin, you know, or turning your group over to somebody else. Or if you're content with posting 30 posts in your group when nobody will see it but one person, you know, that's fine too. But I just want people to understand it's a very, very, very simple process to market your group out there in the Starseed groups you know market your page and do all that and that's about all I've got to say on that subject it's late into the night of course in no time here on the east coast of Lemuria west coast of the USA so with that I want to as always tell everybody this is Rockin' Larry Lockin you can find me on Facebook you can find me in most of the uh, Pleiadian groups especially uh, Leah Shapiro's Mothership Pleiadians group you can find me in the French Thinkers, um, as well as the regional and specialty Pleiadian groups. You know, hit me up. Message me. Um, friend request me. Of course, um, Facebook, of course, only allows so many friends, so I think I'm about or at my uh, allotted number of uh, friends I can have, but you can still message me, and I'd be glad to help you, even if you're in another group and don't have anything to do with the Pleiadians, but it's another, you know, star seed or angelic realm type of group or page. Hit me up, and I'll walk you through it. You know, I'll take that 5 to 20 seconds it takes. So with that being said, I want to wish everybody much love, have a great weekend, and send everybody off with a Cosmic Dating Game kiss. Mwah!